Earth. A Toledo native is currently planning his 30th visit to Ukraine, where he'll bring supplies and resources to that country. Jeff Hartman's organization Ukrainian Action is planning to leave this Friday for the next mission. He spoke with NBC24 Sutton Donovan about his work and the one-year anniversary of the invasion. Sutton. Aaron Juliana, Ukrainian action has delivered over 100 truckloads of supplies to Ukraine. Hartman saw the country two weeks ago and said they only plan to keep going. Jeffrey Hartman wouldn't believe almost a year after the invasion of Ukraine that he would still sit in London, planning for trucks to bring aid to the war-torn country. They experience bomb sirens every day. Um, there are missiles shot down literally over the heads of the apartment buildings that friends of mine live in in the safe parts of the country. Hartman started Ukrainian action when the war broke out and his friends in the country needed supplies. Now almost 30 trips have been taken and over 100 truckloads of supplies have been delivered to Ukraine. So we buy uh, pickup trucks, SUVs and ambulances here in the UK. Uh, we have them serviced. We load them up with humanitarian uh, and medical aid and we organize a group of volunteers to drive the vehicles a thousand miles across five countries to the border of Poland and Ukraine. Hartman, a Toledo native, inspired Toledoans like Jim Trum. Trum decided to get behind the wheel of one of Ukrainian Action's trucks and help bring supplies to Ukraine. Drivers on the road would wave and honk and uh, give us the thumbs up sign because we had uh, stickers on our trucks pretty much advertising that we were a convoy of Ukrainian relief supplies. And that made me feel really good. I wasn't sure what kind of reception we would have. Hartman explained that while the group takes it one trip at a time, they see the impact of what they're doing on those trips. He says while he never imagined being here almost a year later, the organization will only keep going. Well, we're going to keep doing exactly what we do now, which is send supplies, send vehicles, send generators, and adapt to the evolving needs that, that are on the ground in Ukraine, whatever they may be. The 30th trip will take place on Friday, which is the one-year anniversary of the invasion. Reporting live in the studio, Sutton Donovan, NBC 24 News.